We are different. How else would you define ourselves, Breezy? We live in our own little world. And we don't care what others think of us. We just like to be different. Well, ever since we were younger, we were always into fashion. We were always the ones to like cut up our clothing. So we would go off, we would feed off each other, and then we decided to be designers because it was a really big passion of ours. And we always, we do everything together though. Yeah, we haven't been separated for more than 24, 24 hours. hours. Only like two like, times? Two or three times? Our, our whole 19, 19 years. years. There's a lot of people that want to get into being a designer, and I think they see other people doing it, and really it's not their passion. Don't do it for the trend. Do it only for the passion because it's a, it's art and you have to really love what you do to make it go far. We just want to make Coco and Breezy like so universal, it can be anything. Our new collection that's called 2020 Collection, we stepped out of the box and we do have a couple like necklace pieces and rings. We do want to branch off and have our brand bigger, you know, get into shoe design. How we make eyewear, it has a lot to do with our personality and our, our glasses is a story. We actually started wearing just regular glasses just to cover our eyes, but going to school was like I mean, it, was, it wasn't. I mean, it wasn't too bad. Yeah, it just was wasn't. Cold, we used to go home crying. crying. Oh my like, god! Oh my god! <laughs> we used to cry oh. when we were younger. So every but day. But the thing is, we used to we used to take it to the head and like really take it in and be sad about it. But then we're like, hold on, why do why we, do we care? care? So mm -hmm. I made some some glasses. I'm like, well, maybe if I wear these, it'll give people something to stare at. And so I made the glasses and. Honestly, like, it's two different personalities. Like, when we wear our glasses, we feel like we can do anything we want. It's like a story that is based on our real life that we turned into, to, you know, a storyline where we think this is really going to happen one day. Yeah, sure. Oh, can. yeah. You can talk about this. You're great. Well, our image is, like, when we go out in public, we always have our glasses on, like I said. But, like, especially when people always ask us, like, the way we dress, where are you guys from? We're, in, we're living in year 2020 where we think we're the future of fashion. Like, the way we dress... This is, like, in, in 10 years, this is going to be normal. Everybody's going to, you know, be in the same style and really be in that state of mind where they do not care. Should I say it, like, shortly? Sure. Oh. Uh, what, do you remember it or no? No. <laughs> <laughs> like, for so. us, when we first started, it was definitely, it wasn't easy. Like, we went from, like, our first month... Like, not knowing how we're going to pay rent to, like, Because, like, we, we didn't want to ask our parents for anything. anything. So our room had no windows. We're making glasses in there to, like, now we're just, you know, we're doing well. So I just feel like everyone has to know that you have to go through that struggle. And going through a struggle is nothing embarrassing or nothing. It shows that you're on your grind. We, we hand make everything at home. So it's like, when I see a celebrity or a random person, it makes me, like, feel really good inside to know why I really made this at home. And I see someone on the streets in another country or on the internet or a celebrity in a magazine wearing something that we made and designed by hand that we touched. So it's really like, it's actually touching and it really makes us happy Makes us feel really good. It's almost a confident thing. So when you have them on, you feel very confident because you actually have people coming up to you, oh my gosh, you look great type thing. So it's, it's a lot of people that we normally wouldn't see rock our shades or even like be fashionable, like wearing them. So the like, other day we were in Union Square and we seen this girl, she was rocking them out. And I, I, I almost wanted to say, oh my gosh, your shades are hot. But I, was, I don't know, we get shy. Why do we get shy? I had butterflies in my stomach. I was going to walk up to her and I was like, hold on, I have butterflies in my stomach. I can't even go over there. I don't know, I think, but it, it makes me feel so great because it's like, like people can just express their feelings and in the way they, they are, dress. by the way they dress, and it's just artwork. I like, think what people, other people think it's weird, I think it's normal. And so when someone has like a plain like, white t-shirt and jeans, they look at me like, ew, why do you have that on? I want to say, why do you only have white t-shirt and jeans on? Yeah, we're human, and they're human. We just need to be confident of like what we do and who we are. And I feel like by us um, getting our confidence up and not caring anymore what people, um, like, you know, say, who cares? We want to like just show, we want to be a, a we want to be like a, um, a role model to other people that are afraid to step out the box. And that if you go to a room with like 100 people, that one person is going to stand out only because of our eyewear. 